How's it going everyone? Welcome to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Michael. I do coding tutorials on YouTube. In today's video, I'm going to be talking about some of the more useful features on the Leak Code platform that you should be using in your interview preparation. Definitely like and subscribe and let's get into the video. The first and by far one of the most useful features on Leak Code is the discussion forum. You can go to the discussion forum by clicking the discuss tab. Inside of these forums, you have access to interview questions that people post interview experiences, compensation, career, general discussion, and support and feedback on the platform. At least for interview preparation, you should mainly be focusing on the interview question tab. And here you can find a fully curated list of questions that people post. And if you look at the three top pinned interview question threads, you can see that they are a list of questions specifically asked at Microsoft, Google, and Amazon. So normally you can only get access to specific questions that are asked by particular companies if you have Leak Code Premium, but anybody can go on the discussion forums and view these threads. So for example, if I go to Google Online Assessment Questions, you can see that this is a full list of questions that have been known to be asked at Google. One of the moderators has completely aggregated all of these questions together into one thread, and they're even separated by location and interview experience. And keep in mind, this is only the top three threads, but if you actually sort by newest, you can see that questions are posted all the time across many different companies, not just Google and Facebook and Amazon. So if you want to solve problems that are outside of the Leak Code problem set, definitely head over to the forums and you can pick and choose what problems you wanna solve. And this leads to the next feature that I really like on Leak Code, and that is the playground. The playground allows you to compile and run code in whatever language that you want inside of the Leak Code platform. What I really like using the playground for is I will go and pick and choose specific problems on the forums and I will copy over that problem statement into the playground and solve it there. I think this is a really good way to perform interview preparation if the problems that you're trying to solve are not in the Leak Code problem set. And now you have all of the problems that you would have solved inside of the Leak Code platform together. The next feature I really like is the notes. So any problem that you click on, you can go to this right hand side. It's a little transparent box. It's kind of hard to see, but when you click on that, you can actually write down different notes for this specific problem. This is really helpful for your interview preparation because you can go inside this box and type out briefly how you're going to approach the problem. Additionally, when you actually finish the problem, you can write out the time and space complexity of your solution. This is really useful because if you ever have to go back to this specific problem a couple months later, you can just go to your notes and read what your solution was. I don't know about you, but reading code after many months later is really hard to understand in a lot of cases. And I'd much rather read a nice little description that I wrote out about how to solve it. And also writing out your time and space complexity will definitely give you really good practice as to be very consistent with it. Because if you're in an interview, you're definitely going to have to provide that to your interviewer. The last feature I really like on Leak Code is sessions. Sessions are a great way for you to separate your studying. You can see right now I'm on the practice session and this will allow me to essentially start fresh on each session. So all of the problems that I've solved in one session will not be present in another. This is really useful because let's say I have an interview coming up at Google. I can create a new session called Google session and now I can make this session completely focused on just solving Google questions. And you could really branch this off to anything. You could create an Amazon session, Facebook session, dynamic programming session. It doesn't really matter. It's just a way to allow you to separate your concerns with all of these types of problems that are on Leak Code. It can be very easy to get overwhelmed when solving all of these problems but using this feature can allow you to focus on whatever the session is intended for. So those were the useful features on Leak Code that you should definitely be using. I hope they were helpful for you. Utilizing all of these features will definitely improve your interview preparation. If you like this type of content and want algorithm and data structure tutorials, definitely subscribe and don't forget to check out my Patreon if you want access to my private Discord channel. And with that, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.